what is going on everybody i hope everyone is doing well all right today we are going to take a look at 3.24.2 as it just was released and as always we have to start everything all over again <laughs> okay so let's go ahead let's make sure that all our graphics are the way that we want it to be so this is all fine borderless yes direct 11. So, yes i want vulcan because that's what i like to play it on DLSS, yes please. Quality is on high, medium, very low, medium, medium, high, ultra. Medium. Now the reason why I'm not putting this all on high is uh, my computer works hard enough to play this game and at the same time record. So don't want to push the computer too hard. Uh, I know that I'm going to have to restart the game because I chose Vulcan. Right at the bottom left of the screen, you can see optimizing shaders for Vulcan. Wow. 81,000. It's definitely a lot more than what it was for uh, 324.1. As you can see, we don't have our friends list over here, and that's because we have to start everything all over again. I have not seen anything whatsoever. I'm not part of the PTU or the Persistent Test Universe. I choose that because there's so many people out there, so many YouTubers that are part of the PTU, and uh, they create them like they create amazing content themselves in regards to the gameplay. So you know, like you can see what's happening. Um, just the thing is, a lot of the times when they're playing on the PTU, uh, they have specific servers for that so the game actually operates i think in my opinion anyways again i'm not a programmer so don't take my word to heart but um, i think that those specific servers are the ones that are like the best servers holy bushy hair oh this guy has dreads oh, that's cool. all right let's see if we can load my guy up please there it is. load i don't want to check out the hair now here. Kind of look like a samurai style. Ooh, Mohawk. Ah! <laughs> so if they had this style but a little bit more bushier hair, then that would definitely, definitely suit me. <laughs> what do we got? Long hair, we got some. Oh, that one's pretty cool. I like how the hair sways. Like, look at that. That's so cool. <laughs> uh, I got some serious dreads going on here. They had, like, this hairline, but curlier. That would definitely be new. Anyways, whatever. Okay, so uh, let's go ahead and save that. Confirm. Write it. And, uh, there we go. Okay, play a tutorial. Oh, we don't need that. Alright, so now we've got to select our system. There's only one system to stamp in. And where are we going to put Teen Orison? Um, Orison's alright. It takes a really long time to get out of the out of the atmosphere. Loreville again, takes way too much time to get to the hangars. Area 18, same thing. Honestly, New Babbage. New Babbage is like probably the nicest looking one. Oh, there we go. All right, let's see. I haven't really did anything like that. Okay, so let's see. Appointment. Look for what? Me with wallets and grim <laughs> That's a little, uh, sketchy given the fact that Grim Hex is more of a pirate piece but who knows maybe we'll go out there and see uh see what's there also I heard that the reputation got reset with this one so let's go ahead and see uh no it didn't okay sweet deal so we are still on member Whee! Ugh. okay good I didn't hurt myself oh I did son of a okay. Catch the train, catch the train, catch the train, catch it, catch it, catch it. Yeah! Yes, <laughs> Alright. Made it inside. Let's get going.
Maybe back up a little bit. Yeah, there we go. Definitely running a lot smoother. Like, look at this. Like, every single time I come and play in this game, I see this graphics. It's it's honestly really beautiful. Look at those clouds. The trees, the landscapes. Alright, usually when we do these turns, uh, the train goes a little uh, wonky. Let's see if it does it. Ready, ready, ready. Alright, whoa, hello. Uh... <laughs> I'm a little scared. What's happening? Where am I? What the heck? This is beyond wonky. What is going on here? Oh no. And the game is frozen. Is there a server crash? It's a 30k. The ice fields look different. Looks more like ice. Like a frozen lake than just being frosty. Oh, 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 here we go, here we go, here we go. And uh, is it gonna go, is it gonna go wonky? It's slowing down. Slowing down, make the turn, make the turn, okay. <laughs> make the next turn, make the next turn. How's it looking back there? Okay, okay. Oh. Okay. Uh -huh. The tube's a little misaligned. Okay. It worked. We made it. <laughs> still think the light bleed is still a little much, but I, I don't remember that lens flare that's happening. I don't know if you guys can see that purple and kind of like yellowish and green little circles. So that is called lens flare, and that's usually because of uh, the light ricocheting or yeah, ricocheting through the, the light, the lens. So let's take off our helmet and see if that goes away. Our helmet's off and we still have the lens. Looks cool, but yeah, that's something that should, uh, I think should be fixed because in real life, you don't really see the lens flare with your naked eye. Usually you see it through either a camera or maybe even your glasses. So when your helmet's on, it makes sense because you do have that glass that's protecting your face, right? So, or even if you have the other ones which has small eyes, which is, I think, supposed to be like cameras. Again, using the lens, you know, that, that's understandable. But I think this whole light bleed with the lens flare, like all this here, should be uh, removed when you have your helmet on. Let's call a ship and check out the new uh, HUDs. Uh, HED, which stands for Heads Up Display. Welcome to the ASOC vehicle. Something that I'm excited to uh, talk about. Please visit us again. Goodbye. Oh, and they, uh, they reduced the noise, which is kind of nice. Like, maybe have the noise for the first two to three seconds and then cut it off my opinion anyways. but I like the lights flashing everything's nice and it looks visually nice so I believe that it's gone darker wait hold on I don't have my helmet so how am I turning on my flashlight what what Interesting. <laughs> Here's the ladder. 
enter. Do we have any other open ladder, open canopy? That's cool. Oh yeah. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Yeah. I'm really liking this. Really liking this. Okay, first thing I gotta do is change my uh, peripherals. Not my peripherals, just my view. Hold on. Um, field of view. Let's bring it to like 106. I think I just... Does it say oh, okay here we go right here no nope. right here is where it says nav mode or SCM mode okay so we are in SCM mode weapons we have one two three four shields cooling so kind of have to relearn all this supposed to be some kind of thing maybe it's because I don't have my helmet get out okay helmet's back on there's supposed to be some kind of like thing there for the shields oh maybe it's because ah there it is yeah okay it's because I didn't have my helmet oh okay here we go is this a focusing thing why am I still stuck in this view? Alright, let's try this one more time. Okay, so I just figured out what happened here. I was in this view. And then... In order for me to get out of this view, was actually... Or to get into this view, to toggle through this view, I should say, was the right mouse button. Alright, you know what? Let's go see what this guy wants. Uh, Let's take off. Granted. Whoa, that's loud! Oh, there's the open canopy. Why is that so loud? Because it's so far away. It might have hit something, my bad. And then all of a sudden, dead quiet. Man, this thing's quick. Maneuver so well, look at that. <laughs> that looks so nice. Like, look, 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 just look. Look at the graphics, just look. Oh, look, they even have the ripples on the on the clouds. Seating, maybe? Who knows? <laughs> oh, and I like how everything's all green and flashing, like, ready to go for quantum. That looks friggin' awesome. Ah, why are these popping up like this inside the cockpit? Me no likey. What? My guns are gimbling moving. Are you joking? What? Are you serious? Where's my ship? Oh my gosh. This is what I mean, like... Why was that interaction button right there? Oh, this... This game. This game. 
Okay, so there is uh, one major flaw that I can see with this version that it needs to be addressed. Okay, this time I'm going to be trying another server. Um, yeah, so the last couple of times that I fell through just before the ASOP terminals, this was at the US server. So now I'm going to be trying the U, U, uh, EU server or U, UE server. Oh my goodness, I got my whole C back. I got my whole C back. Yes. <laughs> oh my goodness, I'm so happy about that. I'm so happy. I really wish there was a way that we can sell ships in the game. Like having a used ship market. That would be really, really good. Just a place where you can sell ships. Hey, so some good news. <laughs> this thing looks awesome. Another thing too is I really wish there was a we knew a place where we can buy paint schemes, so we can change the paint schemes of these things. Like, I know that you can go ahead and go to the RSI website, you can buy the paints, but again, it would be cool if we were able to buy it in-game. There are some paint schemes that, um, that you're able to buy, I just don't know it all, which would be nice. Okay, that's closed. Let's turn... Alright, so that is going to be it for this video. Um, for the most part, I'm really liking on the new changes that uh, this update has given us. So I know that there is uh, a lot of things that still need to be fixed, uh, as we saw in this video, some of the glitches. But we'll do the continue doing the 10 days. Oh, that guy went quick. <laughs> We're going to continue doing the 10 days in a star citizen uh, now that we have the whole sea back which i'm super happy about maybe we'll do some more missions uh to get that going i know that there was some problems with loading with the with the hull sea hopefully cig fixed that one and uh okay bye <laughs> and on that note and people with being so what are you doing <laughs> if you like this kind of video why don't you go ahead think about subscribing don't, hit, don't forget to give us a thumbs up if you like the video. And also, don't forget to hit the notification bell so that way that you are notified every time we release a new video. Until the next time, we'll see you out in the verse.